points, I'm Mega Man, and you better be watching the Gamers Attic Show or I'll blast you! Hey guys, welcome to the Gamers Attic Show. Welcome to the podcast. I am your host, Player One, and today we have a special treat for you. We have my good friend Adrian, aka Mustache Mega Man, and he's got the Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom Special Edition OLED console. <sighs> oh, it's the yeah. OLED console? I thought it was the sword. Is it the sword? Oops. Is it the sword? You didn't... You, you said you were going to email me what, what video we were doing. Which one are we doing? You said it was the sword. I thought it was a console. I could have sworn it was the sword. Are you joking? Which console are we talking about? Oh, okay. We're doing the sword or we're doing the console? Oh, the console! Oh, you mean this one? <laughs> you dumbass. <laughs> you had me there. <laughs> okay, yes, so... we are doing the unboxing of the Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom Special Edition OLED console. <laughs> Unnecessarily See, right, long names, but let's get off, to it. But... <laughs> okay. The box has the nice, uh, the box has the nice image. I believe this is going to be the cover image for The Legend of Zelda. On the side here, it has Nintendo logo. On the back here, you're looking at essentially how it looks like. And I'm not showing the other side because it has my name, address, and everything else for someone creepy to show. Oh, that's okay. No, no one will, no one will bother you. I know no one will bother me, but I don't want to take that risk. I'm a very unpopular guy. <laughs> okay, now my question. Okay, here we go. So look, man, I got my Legend of Zelda shirt, man. I'm so look at this. Yeah, I I came. Uh, uh, this was the closest thing to Legend of Zelda I had. Um, he shows up in Mario Kart. He's in Mario Kart, you know. Yeah. Eight, <laughs> eight generations later. I love the shirt though. It's still awesome. Oh yeah, it was a gift for my birthday. I. I plan on getting a Zelda shirt, but my girlfriend's got to get me one from the Nintendo store. Okay, so let's open you up. Oh, okay, so the other way. So you gotta open it that way, and then open it this way. Ooh. Ooh, nice. The Joy-Cons. Nice. They have that nice, um... Text, uh, textile design? It's the design for the game itself, essentially. And this was three hundred and eighty-nine dollars, right? Uh, I guess so. Yeah, I guess if you take tax, it's about twenty dollars. So you could say it's about three hundred eighty dollars. So these are the Joy Cons that comes with it. You have like a nice gold with a design on it, and then the back is just completely white. I love it. It looks nice, man. No, oh, yeah, it does. <laughs> Here we have the console itself. Obviously, the front design because it's an OLED model doesn't have anything on there because the screen's bigger. But I don't know if you can see it, but the back of the console has like the circular designs, like yeah. on the, like on the, uh, like on the right Joy-Con. Oh yeah, I see it. I see it. Really nice. That outer shell that looks really, really sweet, man. <laughs> yeah, essentially. I thought, I thought it was about time to get an upgrade. At least I hope it's about time to get an upgrade. Oh, Jesus Christ. So before I show you the front. So this is the back, this is the back compartment of it. Okay. And then the front design is just. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's beautiful, man. Yeah, I like that. So yeah, guys, what did you guys think about this Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom 
special edition OLED console? Let me know in the comments. And uh, Adrian, aka Mustache Mega, thank you for presenting that. All right, guys, so let me know in the comments what you think about this console. Again, thank you for watching. Adrian, aka Mustache Mega, thank you for being here on the Gamers Attic podcast show. I'm going to be saying now, game over. TGA.